So clearly guys, you can hear that the Motorola One Vision has a better amplifier. I mean, this phone can play really high resolution music. And uh, I think they tune it really, really good. I'm not sure if it's a hardware thing that they actually emphasize on or it's a software thing, but the Motorola One Vision really, really beats many competition in their speakers. You know, especially like phones like very, very great flagships. The quality of the output is really great. Now the thing about uh, Dolby Atmos, you can actually uh, customize it and make it, for example, it's for, uh, so there's two types. There's movie and there's music. There's two types. If you click on the movie, let me just check you out. Check the, I don't want to tell you. I want to make this like an educational, but I want you to show you how it actually functions. Because it's amazing how they actually can manage such a, such, such output. When you go to Dolby Atmos, so uh, you have lots. So Dolby Atmos always on on the phone. You cannot turn it off. And the thing is, the smart audio, which is the phone identified. So I, I don't recommend this. I recommend you do it manually. So if you listen to music and only music, choose the music. That's it. That's the best thing I can, you know, recommend for you. If you are listening to podcasts, listening to shows, basically people talking, you know, vocals, just click on mu movies or movie because read this authentic surround sound and clear dialogue for the full impact of movies and TV shows. So dialogue, movies, uh, music, choose the music and enjoy the time. They really, really nailed it with this phone, guys. I don't know how Motorola mm -hmm. was able to do it. So yeah, that's about it, guys. If you have any questions, let me know in the comment section below. If you want me to put this phone against another better speakers, so to speak, let me know. See you guys later.